if you know, you know, okay? I'm not gonna go too much into detail, but if you know, you know. Hey, what's up, you guys? I decided that I wanted to do a video like I've seen a lot of people here on YouTube doing. It's the New Year's resolutions video. So I wanna go over some goals that I have for this year in a few different areas of my life. So I have my little notebook here. I just have to show you guys a few pages. Like, look how pretty and colorful. Look how cute that is. So I always say that I want this or better. And the reason being is because I don't want to limit myself to this being my top goal. I want this to be my minimum goal. And then once that goal is achieved, I have my top goal, which is unlimited. So I always write my goals, this or better. So my YouTube goals are to reach 50,000 subscribers at least. Obviously this or better. So I'm only at I think as I film this, I'm at 1,224 subscribers. And mark my words, this year I will grow on YouTube. I will have a lot of growth on YouTube that's going to be organic, that's going to be genuine, and that's going to help me build a community here. I definitely am looking forward to my first paycheck from YouTube. I still haven't gotten there yet. Now, I started becoming monetized at the end of May, about May 26th, I believe, of 2020. So it hasn't been a full year yet, but I still have not received my first paycheck yet. I'm almost halfway there. If you guys know what I mean, you need at least $100 for YouTube to send you a paycheck. So my first paycheck is definitely, definitely going to happen in 2021. And it's definitely one of my top, top goals for YouTube. My next goal is to have my first sponsorship on YouTube. Now, this is definitely something that I hold at a really high value because I love marketing and I love the business side of YouTube and I am just so excited to be involved with brands that I believe in and to be able to build an audience that believes in me and that trusts me in order to advise them. So I'm kind of like your little personal shopper in a way, which I love. So I'm really excited to get into that side of things this year and to definitely get some sponsorships for YouTube. My next goal is to post quality over quantity this year. And that is at least one time a week. And the reason I say quality over quantity is because the last year I have posted a lot of videos like over a hundred videos or something crazy like that like probably 130 videos or something like i i posted a lot and the reason i posted a lot is because i didn't know what was quality and what was actually going to be worth it for me to invest my time into the next goal that i have is that i want to start theming my days theming my days means that one day i want to film one day i want to edit one day I wanna brainstorm for the video. I wanna have different modes of operation for each day. So first of all, not each day is mundane and the same every day, but also so I can stay in a mode of focus. For me, I benefit so much from just editing all day five videos rather than filming and editing and doing everything all in a day. All of those things take a different part of your brain in a way. So I want to honor that and I don't want to switch back between tasks too many times because I've heard from, I think it was Jay Shetty. He had probably quoted somebody on this saying that it's really hard to go from your rational mind to your creative mind. Am I focused? Guys, I think I just can't see. My next goal is to get noticed by the YouTube algorithm. So what do I mean by that? I am looking for one of my videos to take off. I'm just I'm just looking for that one. I don't need more than one. My goal this year is at least one. So this or better guys, this or better. Please, if you like my videos, share them, like them, subscribe. Okay, my next goal is to make better thumbnails. And this is going to be accomplished by the help of my boyfriend. So I had spoken with him earlier and he told me that he would definitely help me. I don't know too many things in Photoshop. I'm not so well versed in it and I don't even have it on my computer honestly at the moment. So I'm gonna have him help me with editing some of my 
thumbnails to make them a little bit more interesting and a little more eye-catching and more beautiful so I can get noticed by that YouTube algorithm and step up my content and hit all these goals that I say that I want to reach and in order for me to do that making better thumbnails is definitely definitely the next goal of mine is to upgrade to Final Cut Pro or Premiere, but most likely Final Cut Pro. Now, the reason that I say Final Cut Pro or Premiere is because, of course, I'm open to either. I heard that either way I go, I'm going to be in good shape, but I do know that Premiere is a little bit more professional, maybe not in my ballpark of price right now at the moment just because you need to pay monthly for it and honestly I think that I might just rather purchase Final Cut Pro for $300 but we'll see we'll see so I will be learning a new software this year and I'll probably do a YouTube video on it just because I know that I'm gonna be in the dark and I'm sure that there's a lot of other people out there like me so I will definitely be doing some videos on Final Cut Pro and kind of how I adjust to the new software another huge goal of mine is to post more searchable videos and that's how I will be able to up level myself and to up level my content so I can get noticed by the Instagram algorithm so I can grow my subscribers it all goes hand in hand guys you guys see the pattern here it's just going to be more organized this year and more put together hopefully so fingers crossed <laughs> so that's it for all of my YouTube goals. In the growth and learning category, I'm looking for this or better. I want to learn more about human design. Another one is NLP, right? In my weekly mindset journal, meditate every day, do some release work, learn more about the ego and the subconscious. And our subconscious just absorbs everything that you don't even realize. Have you guys ever seen Focus, the movie with Will Smith? If you know, you know, okay? I'm not gonna go too much into detail, but if you know, you know. Another huge thing that I want to focus on is reading. So I do want to focus more on audiobooks because I feel like I'll be able to accomplish more reading that way. But I also do wanna focus on physical paperbacks as well. So there is no exclusion. I wanna make sure that I'm doing both paperbacks and audiobooks. Another big thing is I want to practice minimalism even more than I already have and some might say well you're definitely not a minimalist and I'm, I'm not in, in any sense of the way I think but I'm trying and I'm taking steps and I truly need to clean out my closet again it's atrocious I'm in shock that I've cleaned it out already so many times and it just keeps keeps piling up. Another one is to take more pictures for Instagram, but like more natural in the moment pictures and not yoga and not modeling, just pictures for Instagram. That's like a huge, huge goal of mine. That is everything for growth and learning. There is one more category that I wanna go over with you guys and that is health and fitness. So this or something better, for sure. I want to be drinking at least eight glasses of water a day, preferably a gallon a day but at least eight glasses, okay? That is bare minimum daily. Winter, summer, doesn't matter, bare minimum. I want to make sure that I am stretching and doing yoga once a day. Another main thing is daily movement, which is super easy because I have a puppy and he is required to go out at least five times a day. So I go out at least five times a day and I'm constantly moving, but I just wanna make sure that that stays always in my schedule and always in my goals. And working out five days a week from home. So I have not worked out in a really long time. I've kind of let myself go, kind of lost um, a lot of muscle and gained a lot of weight, but, 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 I have goals, guys. I have goals and I'm gonna get back to them. So those are all my goals, guys, and that is my video for today. I really hope that you guys enjoy this new content, and I hope you guys enjoy my new style, my new style of editing, and I hope that it just grows and everything grows this year in such a positive way because 2020 was definitely a little bit eh, for everyone. So. Whether you had a good year or a bad year last year, I know that we're all gonna have a great year because we decide to have a great year. So, cheers to 2021. Oh, I have my water here, guys. Cheers. Oh my God. And that's everything, guys. So, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. 
sometimes the dreams that are that come true are the dreams that you never even had. Wow, that was a whole mess. Sometimes the dreams that come true are the dreams you. One more time. 